Hey hi my zoners, this is Sam. And right now I have something special for you guys and that's NVIDIA's Project Shield. This is all a little hands-on. So I'm gonna show you the device. It's NVIDIA's first handheld gaming device. It looks exactly like, uh, well not really exactly, but it looks like an Xbox 360 controller. So it's a console great controller. You have your bumper buttons here, your trigger buttons here, a mini HDMI for connecting to the TV, you have a micro USB for charging, you have a headphone jack, and a custom faceplate that you can remove so you can easily trick it out to make it your own. So yeah, this is the shield on the outside. On the inside, you have a 5-inch 720p retinal display with 10 touch points, so you can use your, all your fingers. You have two speakers, you have your D-pad, you have two analog sticks, or right analog sticks for controlling a mouse, and then over here is X, Y, A, B buttons, which is pretty much your standard controller. And then you have a start button, your volume button, and then you have a back button and a home button. And then right in the middle, you have your NVIDIA custom game launcher, which takes you directly to your games. So yeah, you can look at it. You can go to Tiger Zone, you can even stream content from your PC directly to the Shield. And it's powered by Android Jelly Bean 4.2. So you can get everything you want from the Play Store. All your favorite games on the Play Store are available on the Shield. You can enjoy Max Payne, GTA. So yeah, this baby runs on the Tegra 4 with a 4 plus 1 architecture ARM Cortex A15 and 72 GeForce GPUs, so it's pretty powerful. It has Wi-Fi built in, so you can download all your games. And yeah, that's pretty much the shield at a look at it. But right now we're gonna show you the performance. So I have Sonic over here. So here's Sonic. It's pretty much the same thing you see in the Android Play Store. Let's play a game. So generally if you're having a smartphone, you'll be playing with your hand, your fingers on the smartphone, covering all the entire display you can see what you're doing. But with the shield, everything goes away and you're just gaming. You have good, thanks to the Tegra 4, you have really good graphics. It's really clear, HD quality content. And the sound. It's the loudest we've ever heard on a gaming device, a handheld gaming device. So, that's just Sonic. But let's take a look at another game. Here's Shadowgun. As you can see, it's pretty much a console quality experience on a handheld. That's exactly what Project Shield brings to you. So that concludes our little hands-on with the Project Shield. Currently this is an engineering sample, so we may expect the device to change in the future, but when it comes out, we'll let you know more details. So follow us on the Hardware Zone, stay tuned for more updates. This is Sam signing out.